It's the one that just missed this rod next to me. I guarantee it. My drag was a little loose on that and he was burning it alive. This drag ain't that loose. All right, guys, James at River Lunacy. We're back out on the Ohio River. We're gonna do some cat fishing today. Um, I have been fishing some off and on. It's not been real great. River is about to go up today, any given moment now. So it's got some pressure behind it. Probably got a little speed on its way, I'm sure. Um, but, um, I'm just in a little bit of a shallow area here. It's 15 where I'm sitting, and it drops on down to 18, 19 on back. A little bit of brush. I've seen a couple fish, and I want to see if they want to start biting. It's just an interesting-looking little area. I think the water temps are just a little warmer closer into the bank, so that's where I'm at right at the moment. Um, here soon, we're going to start fishing some trees and probably... Uh, uh, rock ledge on the main channel so let's cut some bait got some fresh shad and I don't have no walk uh, no rods in the water yet so let's get moving on that Five foot of water, guys. The one over here on the other side off the other ledge got smoked too. It dropped it though. We might not be moving for a while. This fish got some muscle behind him. Get my grips. I haven't seen him yet, but I don't want to lose another one on camera. Nice fish. There goes that one. Oh. I ain't even got all my rods in. Man, they're excited today. Oh, it's a good fish. That's a good fish. Take it. skunks out good fish take the skunk out of the boat take that no white bass there we go <laughs> log on my line too. No. Shoot, man. Oh, this fish is getting a snag. Darn. Worked his way out. Feels like a good one. I got rods all over, guys. Man, if this day continues to go like this, 
we're we're gonna have fun. <laughs> Love it when they're biting. So far, it's looking good. Looking good. Shallow water. Like I said, I'm sitting on 15 foot on a ledge. It's five foot up there, way out there, drops into the 20s. It ain't a, it's not deep. I mean, it's cold too. My fingers are burning. Just noticed that the mud flat over here towards the bank is just a little warmer. Another nice quality fish. I mean, good size regular Ohio River fish. Hit my pink kitty collar. Ah, come on, bud. Come on, man. Do that. Fish. Take it. There's one for the deeper water. Ah, they got mud on them. It's a good one. Take it. How we dove. That one was plastered to the side of the ledge. Come flying straight down it. Still not even up with all my rods in the water, guys. Get a picture of you. Good Lord, Gore. Yeah. We are having fun today. Goodness. Oh. Hey, hey, hey. Sorry. I'm a dentist. Man, look at that girl. Whoa, she's a triangle. Mud all over her back. Cover the mud. Wow. Man, he smoked that thing. This one over here got hit too, I believe. Like a bigger fish at first. He's kind of coming up to me, is what he's doing. I'll take a hook slide here in a second. Ready. Uh, just 
just he is a little guy, he's just smoking. Come on, baby, you can do it. I'm trying to cast for Skipjack. He's got it. Has he got it? Yeah, he's got it. Look at him. Oh, youngster. Come on, baby, pull it down a little more. You can do it. <laughs> he's still got it. Fish. He's a little guy, but he's fun. Smallest. <laughs> he had to let us know he was here. Oh. Hit the green kitty call, trophy cat tackle. second time now again I keep moving around I don't really want to leave this area quite yet and this one is up in that really shallow water pretty interesting You can miss it. Hoping he'll miss this other rod. Oh, he got it. Dang it. No, we're screwed. We got it all. Oh, well. Another nice little youngster covered in mud. Oh, man. I might just go shallow. I mean, I was pretty shallow a little while ago. It didn't really work out, but. I move further back. Maybe I'll go at an angle in. I don't know. Let's see what happens here real quick. There we go. Fish on. I went downstream and fished some real deep water, 57 foot, and didn't get a bite. Sitting in 25 right now with some structure behind me. Second rod to go down in three minutes. 
The other one slipped on him. This one's trying to act like he's heavy all of a sudden. Maybe he was coming in at me before, but he just put the brakes on. Had his brakes on. Fish moving around in here. That was a strong little fish right there. hooked in the bottom of the jaw a little bit. They don't like that too much. <laughs> oh, yeah, they don't like it too much when they get hook slips around and goes through that bottom. We'll let him have that bait. There you go. Nice one. Probably only gonna give this a couple minutes, eh? They seem to really want to let you know right away if they're in here, and I've been sitting here a little while before those two fish hit. It's just a lot of real nice little rock and uh, trees seen some small fish, some bait fish, and uh, a couple big fish. Really plan on seeing too many big fish today. Too many blue cats up moving around because I seen all that mud all over them. Although, if they're up out of the mud moving around, I'll see them. I'll see some on the graph. I got one underneath me right now. I got a suspended rod sitting there. I wish he'd grab that. We did have one take off earlier on a suspended rod. He didn't hook up though. out to a hump here might be 35 behind me I'm sitting on 28.2 structure down in there male male fish with a big mouth on him ah come on come on he hit a chunk piece on the Carolina rig there's another one hitting this one here let him go. Let's get this one. Double. Oh, he feels good. Wow, he's strong, ain't he? Seemed. <laughs> They're amped up today, boys and girls. Wind's getting really cold, though. Kind of blowing me sideways a bit here. This is a better one here. This is a better fish. He's he wants to stay down. 
definitely a little slow about things down in there. He's playing the playing the old ride the current thing for me. Moved into some other stuff that I'd normally catch a little bigger fish, hoping we can get us one nice one for the day. That would be all right. Too bad. I think that we caught all babies today. We just uh, like to see a bigger one, that's for sure. That's a male. Oh, he's a little rough for me, too. Calm down, big mouth. Bad. right now there we go that's a male fish he's a little rough oh oh man that's the one that just missed this rod next to me I guarantee it drag was a little loose on that and he was burning it alive. This drag ain't that loose. Man, strong fish. Try to keep him out of that rod there. Barely, I mean, I literally just got like two or three rods in the water. It's probably going to be a better fish for the day right here so far. Just hope there's more right here. It's kind of a hump further out from the bank. It's got some structure on it down below behind it. I really didn't mark any fish, but I marked bait fish down through there. You don't always see them. They get a little smell of something next to them that wakes them up out of that structure. A strong little guy right here. I was mad about that other one. He had that thing bent down. The boat was sideways. I was blaming it on the boat. But my drag was just a hair loose. Or just yeah, it's just a nice fish. I was thinking he would have been a little bigger. That's a pretty good fish, though. Can't complain about that. Now he got my got my headpiece. He's got somebody's. Hey, he's got somebody's hook down in his gullet. I'm gonna um. Red cage in line, brass swivel, that's yours. It was a nice fish, but it wasn't a monster. I'm gonna go ahead and uh, try to get that hook out of his throat, guys. So, oh. set him down for a minute. Stop the camera for a second. Up 
up in the shallow water again, guys. Actually just had two go down on this side, the channel side. They didn't hook up, unfortunately. At the same time, I think they scared each other, bouncing the rods around. Been a fun day. I'm out here a little later than I wanted, but I leave now, I'll be in rush hour traffic, so might as well sit back and have a coffee and try to catch a couple more fish. Wow, there's a monster under us. <laughs> I got a suspended rod still. It's got an eight ounce on it, so I'm thinking I'm gonna throw it up in the shallow water too. fish. Oh, another nice fish there. Come here, lassie. Come here, old lassie. Ah, don't spin, don't spin. Oh. Oh. They're healthy right now. Nice fish, still mud on her. Let her go. That one's pretty shallow, probably five foot. If that, oh, what's he doing? Lose him? He's flying towards me. It's crazy. He felt like a good fish at first, but he's really, really moving fast. Very excited little blue cat. <laughs> he is so excited. Couldn't wait to. feisty feller. We sure smoked it though. <laughs> God darn. <laughs> Jeez, man. They are fun. Next to a, next to a uh, barge cell here, trying some different stuff, and it is not working out. 
I mean, we got one, so that's... That's a plus, right? But... I also fished a really big hole up in front of me here. And I didn't get anything there at all. And, uh... There's some concrete structure in front of that, a bunch of rock stuff, broken concrete, and nothing. I, mean, I marked fish in all of these spots, and all of them. I actually marked fish, but uh, or marked bait fish too. But a lot of them spots are just not panning out. This one's just got a bunch of rubbish down in there, a big tree pile. Some nice fish. Let him go. Wood and mud seems to really be the thing, you know, at least being in the mud and even on a ledge. I had fish back there uh, where earlier in the video. We might do one more spot, but it's getting pretty late. So, I just had a sip of coffee. I knew that would get one. All right, guys, we're going to end it here. This is my last spot. I just had one annihilate a rod, and he cut me off on something down there in the, in the bottom, fishing some, just a little flat, about 28 foot, and uh, some little structure down through there. But we didn't get him, unfortunately, but we sure caught plenty throughout the day. Still got some rods out just in case. We might turn the camera back on, but I think this is probably going to be it. The sun's going down. You can feel that chill in the air, and the river's getting ready to start rising, so I don't feel like turning my lights on either. I'll catch you guys on the next one. Thanks for watching.